Harris is ramping up her presidential campaign. Today, she spoke to members of a historically black sorority. Our chief political reporter, Susan Raff, is live tonight in Hartford, where she's hearing how women of color feel tonight. Susan. Mark, Kamala Harris is definitely on the campaign trail. Today, she was out and about. She is looking for black voters to be on board with her campaign. And as we know, that is a key voting block in the upcoming election. Today, we were able to speak to women in the greater Hartford area to hear what's important to them. Kamala Harris is focused on winning in November. Wednesday, she delivered a keynote speech at Zeta Phi Beta, a black sorority in Indianapolis. Harris herself was a member of Alpha Kappa Alpha, another historically black sorority. She's reaching out to black women voters. These women are out there saying, I'm with you, Kamala. I'm with you. So am I. Jennifer Marshall Neely says Harris is an accomplished woman of color. Neely is accomplished in her own right. She's a Democratic registrar of voter in Bloomfield, running for state rep, who was the only female on the indoor men's track team when she went to Hartford Public High School. She feels women like Harris are good role models. Not only is she a black woman, she's a black woman who's qualified, prosecutor, strong, knows the law, and not afraid to speak up for what's right. The Biden administration has been struggling to get more support from the black community. Many feel promises were made but not kept. Harris could bring more excitement to the presidential race and possibly more support for Democrats. I've been hearing people saying, well, I don't know, you know, her. Um, I haven't heard her of doing, you know, her doing anything. And, um, and I think that what people should do is, first of all, just give her a chance. While some may be familiar with Harris's prior career as a top prosecutor, they may not know much about what she has done as vice president. But Harris entering the race could get more people to vote. They will find the encouragement to, you know, just come together and... I believe. Kamala Harris was in Kamala Harris was in Connecticut about two years ago and she was pushing to strengthen reproductive rights for women and no doubt that issue will be important in this upcoming election. We are live tonight in Hartford, Susan Raff, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Susan